spin ceramic fibers for energy harvesting is adapting its technology to make lightweight military armor. Advanced Ceremetrics recently received a five-year, $12 million development contract from the U.S. Army Research Laboratory. Science and Technology correspondent Patrick Regan reports. Most of the materials made in Advanced Cerametrics, New Jersey Labs, and Ohio Factory go into products that transform mechanical energy into electricity. Used another way, the same materials actively control vibrations in structures ranging from skis to helicopter blades. But the latest collaboration with the Army builds mainly on a different aspect of the company's processes. The core of our technology is converting ceramic or brittle materials into fiber form that flex or bend. You can take ceramics uh, and bend them into very narrow radius, uh, radii. You can uh, expose them to enormous stresses. Uh, one of the applications that we had with munitions where it survived 60,000 G force, which is huge. Um, and it still produced power throughout the, uh, uh, the entire acceleration. In that experiment, the ceramic fibers were part of a weapon. This is a high temperature composite that you could change the temperature rapidly to very, very high temperature and very, very low temperature without breaking the, um, the objects. And this is uh, for um, high-speed air vehicles. And um, we manufactured the raw material here at Advanced Ceramics from basically this, uh, you know, raw powders. The new project is to exploit ceramic fiber's potential as a shield, adding strength to military armor while reducing its weight. The Army contract calls for the company to work up a large volume manufacturing process for spinning small diameter boron carbide fibers. These in turn could be used to strengthen lightweight metal composites for products from armor to engine blocks. Patrick Regan, NJM News, Lambertville. Add another casualty to those record-breaking fuel prices.